As you can see, this screen is broken. Let's replace it. So, turn off your computer, disconnect it from the charger, and remove the battery. There's going to be two screws under two plastic covers, one here and one here. So now remove the plastic covers and then remove the screws. After that, you can start removing the bezel. Start from the bottom and then move your way up. The bezel is very fragile and hard to take off, so take your time and be patient. Something that should work is prying it open from the side and moving your way up, as shown in the video. Like I said, take your time and be patient. After that, remove two screws that are on top of the screen. Take off three screws on the bottom right corner and two screws on the bottom left corner. Now slowly push the screen a little bit forward. Take off two screws on both sides of the harness that are holding the screen. And gently grab the screen and place it on the keyboard. Then carefully remove the tape that is on top of the video cable. Then carefully remove the video cable. Now you can put your old screen aside and grab your new screen. Now place your new screen on top of the keyboard. Connect your video cable into your new screen. Get some electrical tape, cut a piece off, and place it on top of the video cable. This will secure the connection. Now grab your screen and place it back into the harness. At this point, it is safe to test your screen. Connect it to the charger and turn it on. Make sure your laptop boots up properly. Then just turn it off and disconnect it from the charger. You can either take off the protective cover from the new screen or leave it on. Put the two screws on each side of the harness back on. Put the three screws on the bottom right corner back on. And the two screws on the bottom left corner back on. Then put the two screws on top. Now you can put the bezel back on. Be very careful. Like I said before, it's very fragile. Just slide your fingers all around the bezel until it snaps. Then put the two screws that were on the right corner and the left corner. Now put the plastic covers back on. Now you can put the battery back in. Connect the charger and turn it on. Your new screen should be working. Thanks for watching.